Montserrat was way up in the mountains, a major tourist destination. But we went there as tourists. We had an old man to rescue and an ancient tablet to find. And standing in our way was a cold-blooded killer. Why would the tabula be hidden up here of all places? For hundreds of years, the mountain has been kind of a sanctuary. There's an old Benedictine monastery up the hill. Well, I guess that's where we need to start looking. Wow, it's empty. Where is everyone? This place is normally full of tourists. I don't like the look of this one bit. At least it's not monks with guns. Don't even go there, Nico. Time to bring out the dumb tourist. <laughs> it's a role you were born to play, Georges. I suspected these guys wouldn't let us in any time soon. Nice lamppost. Looking at that fence, I'd guess they had dog issues around here. It was a magnificent building. I wondered if the tabula was really hidden up there. A bench with a view. I guess normally tourists would be fighting over that seat. There, buddy. Sorry. We got a virus loose. Old place is locked down. Howdy. Is this the way up to the monastery? Yeah, but it's shut. No one allowed in. The monks, uh, they're on strike. Wow. What happened? Someone make them work ungodly hours? Nah, I don't think that was the problem. And I guess the virus can't have helped. You know, back in Austin, we have very different attitudes to public health. So go home and stop bothering me. Howdy, fella. Sorry, pal. Monastery's closed. Tell father notice. Oh, gee. Well, ain't that just my luck? Yeah, ain't it? And my two pretty sisters here are so looking forward to seeing the monastery. Life's full of disappointments. Sure seems that way. And the monastery's definitely up there, huh? It is. But it'll still be there tomorrow. Oh, we fly back to Austin tonight. Well, isn't that a shame? So, why's the place closed? VIP visitors. Wow! That's exciting. W which VIPs? A foreign prince. The Prince of Ware. Yeah, that's the one. Wow! So we can't let normal folk in? Oh, of course not. No, not if the Prince of Ware is there. Did you tell the Prince about the virus? What? Your buddy said there was a virus. Did you warn the Prince? Uh, well, there's no need. He's uh, immune. Oh, of course. <laughs> Stupid me. Everybody knows that. Time for you to go, pal. I guess it is. You have a nice day now. And you. Take a hike, pal. Nico, in a scrape like this, you wouldn't want anyone else. Eva looked very determined. I was glad she was on my side. I seriously doubt those guards belong here. I know. You want to try turning on the charm? I'll try. What 
is she doing? Nico usually gets what she wants. If anyone can charm those guys, it's her. What did he say? He suggested I do something. I told him it was anatomically impossible. I'm sure they're Langham, I mean Ganon's men. I agree. I can't get my head around him being a Ganon. I'm gonna stick with Langham. Good idea, Charles. We need to find another way then. Let me have a look around. We're moving away from the monastery. Yes, but with those goons in the way, we have to find a different approach. Maybe there's some other way around, via the cable car station? Or at least someone in the... can tell us what's going on. Someone's coming out! Quick! We need to hide! I think it's Langon! Block everything off. Lock the whole place down, understand? The tabula's got to be up in the monastery, I'm sure of it. Come on! Yes, boss. Close all the routes up to the monastery, and then make the old man talk. Yes, boss. This time, don't be so gentle with him. Did you hear that? They haven't found it yet, but Senor Marquez must be in a bad way. Listen, I have to follow those bastardos. I might be able to slip through on my own. Sure. We'll see if we can find another way up. You think she'll be okay? Eva can handle herself. It was locked. There was a keypad, but I didn't know the code. The cable car hung midway across the valley. It wasn't moving. My God! Nico! What is it? This telescope! It's free! It was the other station for the cable cars. There was a small chapel perched on the edge of the cliff. It looked ancient. There were a couple of people stuck in the cable car. They looked kind of familiar. Then I realized it was my old friends Dwayne and Pearl Henderson. The Hendersons had an uncanny way of showing up wherever I went. They didn't know I'd seen them. I needed to give them a signal. I signaled them back. I wasn't sure they'd seen it. Pearl was mouthing something and gesturing. Pearl seemed to be writing something on the window. It said, Help. Stuck. Door code 0797. I wondered how Pearl came to know that. 
I idly wondered whether there was more to find by looking at the scenery. Wait, what's that? That rock looks familiar. Nico, take a look at this and tell me what you see. You're right. That rock looks like a head. I've seen that sh The face in the Ouroboros, it's exactly the same shape as that rock. That can't be a coincidence. And you know what? Langham's got the forged picture. The one without the face. So the rock won't have meant anything to him. Nico, I don't think the tabula's up at the monastery. I think it's down there somewhere, around that rock. Come on, Nico. Pearl's giving me the code to the door. What? Pearl? Who? How? Trust me, Nico. I've got friends in low-hanging places. <laughs> 